Animal yeah. spirit Hello. guides. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lahat ba ng tao may ganun, supposedly? Yeah, I'd like to believe that because actually the whole aspect of having a spirit guide goes back to even uh, shamanic traditions around the world. Mm -hmm. uh, whether you admit it or not, around the world, sa buong, buong mundo, there mm -hmm. will always be a shamanic tradition. You have uh, Indians, you have medicine men, you have mm -hmm. mga alborarios. Mm -hmm. And what do they yeah. do is they communicate with the spirits of the land mm -hmm. or they communicate with the spirits of the, of the earth itself. And each animal has what we call an aspect. In other words, it's the overall collective energy of that animal. So when you have a spirit guide, it's not you have a wolf as a spirit guide. It's the collective power of wolf. So it's the attributes of wolf, mga pack mentality, um, loyalty, strength. Uh, other animals will resonate to certain people, but each individual, I like to believe, has their own corresponding animal spirit. Eh, paano ito kunwari? Wala naman tayo nung drama. Ako kaya pa nga ang animal ko, butiki. Kasi sabi nila, hindi na ano, diba? So, naisip ko na. It might just be. It really, we don't know unless you go inside the... The butiki. No! Unless the butiki goes inside you. So, in all truth, though, it's a personalized journey, but it's very helpful in self-discovery. Because after discovering this, it can be very helpful to you. Each animal has their own mga attributes and skills. So, it's something to really go through at least once in a lifetime. Okay. How will I know? Okay. Well, if it's the body, for example, it's a No, if it's if it's you, it's baka it's a dove or a swan or something like that. Oh, I'm sweet. How will you know if a person... For example, me, uh, how will you know if I won't know it. You will discover it on your own. So how will we discover it? Okay, one of the things you can do if you can find on the internet, look for a drumming track or join a drumming circle, and that can help you enter the shamanic world. Most people, mga percussion drums talaga. That's one of the things to you. They have. Kasi sumuot ka sa drum pag uwi mo. Hello, hello. So it's all part of it. Um, those who usually do drumming circles actually also know how to allow people to enter the shamanic lower world. But if you want to read more about it, look for the book The Way of the Shaman by Michael Harner. It's a very good book for starting your shamanic journey. Alam mo ba kailangan nating alamin yun? Yeah. No, you. It's something that will help you. Because if you want to understand more about yourself, the the power animal or the shamanic vision animal that appears will give you more answers than questions. It will just oh, put things in perspective. Parang kumbaga, you. when you realize what it is, parang, oo oh, oh, nga, no. Exactly. Parang yeah. ganun siya. Parang Happen you, so many you, times. You understand yourself better na kaya pala ganito ako. Asal hayo. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Yung qualities mo na minsan na, ah, kaya pala minsan ganun ako. Yung pala, ang spirit guide. Mm -hmm. Ang unicorn ba spirit guide? Oh, walang ganun. Yeah, actually, there, there, there are some <laughs> mythical, <laughs> there are some mythical creatures that appear like phoenix, <gasps> dragon. Uh, kasi these things are very symbolic in culture. Like example, there's phoenix in the eastern and the western world. There are dragons ever since mythology time. So these still have aspects in themselves. Oh, oh, oh. Interesting.